video I'm going to teach you on how to fix a uh, preparing automatic repair loop in Windows 11 so it's a very simple process let's get straight into it so I'm just going to go into that screen right now so uh, you guys can get a better understanding of it okay so it should say preparing automatic repair uh, diagnosing your PC and then it should be uh, loading 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 and then you should have a screen that says uh, your PC did not start correctly you have you should have a restart button and advanced options button make sure you select the advanced options button okay so once you select the advanced options you should have a bunch of options okay if you have continue use a device troubleshoot and turn off your PC you're going to select on troubleshoot okay you can try to select on continue but it will only loop the problem again so just click on troubleshoot and then uh, you should get to the screen right here uh, my PC is loading so yeah, I'm just gonna wait for that okay guys so it should bring you to uh, the screen that says troubleshoot just now so once you click troubleshoot you have this screen you can click on advanced options so once you click on advanced options you can click on startup repair so startup repair what it will do it will just allow you to diagnose your PC and it should check for disk errors and it should attempt the repair if you uh, have the startup error and it's still the same uh, what you can do is you can come back into these uh, troubleshoot settings go into advanced options okay you can click on uninstall update and you can click on uninstall latest quality update okay you can click on uninstall latest quality update and find updates on windows um, that you think that newly installed your com on your computer you can just uninstall them okay and see whether that fixes your issue if that doesn't fix your issue you can troubleshoot go into advanced options and then um, you can go into startup settings okay restart your computer here okay and then you can go into safe mode with networking so to select that you can click on number five or f5 so i'm just going to click on f number five Okay guys, so once you're here on safe mode, okay, you can go into here and click on uninstall updates. You can search for uninstall updates and then here you have the date it uh, installed on. So if it's on the latest date, just uninstall it. Okay, so uninstall it and then you can restart your computer and see whether it's fixed your issue okay and if all of this haven't fixed your issue i would suggest you to just reset your pc okay guys so if none of that uh, fixes worked okay and you still end up in the automatic repair screen just go into advance go into troubleshoot go into reset this pc okay so make sure disclaimer you will lose all your files if you choose the remove everything but if you if it still fixes you to keep your personal files it will still remove all of the files that you've installed and downloaded okay so you will lose some of the applications okay so bear that in mind so you just can click on keep my files okay so files will be kept but the apps will be removed so just select on clip my files and it should do a full reinstall of windows and it that should fix your issue if that does not fix your issue at all you can just find a bootable um just make a bootable uh drive with windows on it and then install windows that way so that's all for this video guys i hope it helped if you have any other issues and other problems please put down in the comments below and i think that's about it so thanks for watching folks